else have this thing where you get up and start your day and you don't make your bed first? I do all the time. Just preparing for today and tomorrow's event. I wanted to make sure I had enough time. Uh, today and tomorrow's event is an art show. The first art show in a long time for me. It's actually a group show, so I'm not sure exactly what to expect because I've never had an art show at this gallery before, but it should be fun. Um, and I'm basically ready. I just, I just need to get dressed. Ah. I'm just kidding. This is made out of wood. <laughs> Isn't that cool? I made this actually for wearing at a friend's wedding years ago. I've been meaning to make more, but I just haven't. So I will just wear it again. Anyway, getting ready for this show this morning where I didn't have, thought I didn't have time to make my bed was finishing up this piece and this piece right here because they're going to be unveiled, unveiled at the show. This piece here I've been working on for years and I think I'm finally happy with it like this. So let's pack them up. Oh, originally, this was a piece, if you can see that right there, I it was a different piece and I, I really didn't like it so I painted over it and then I didn't know where to go with the concept I had in my head, but finally, finally it's good. Construction. Gotta love, gotta love construction. <laughs> Look at that little good boy right there. <laughs> that guy's sign says, can't do any work until my arm heals, but God bless him, his arm is not gonna grow back. It's amputated. That's crazy. Uh, nice folks right there. Hey man. Oh, oh, thank you. She looks good, man. You like it? I do. This is my favorite style. We have one version of dime blades for an electrocute. Oh, uh, that's what happened to you? Yeah. Electrocuted? Hey, 25,000 volts. Oh, see damn. Up see you, uh, yeah, see ya. Have a good day. Jesus, his arm was electrocuted off. <laughs> well, dang. I figured if I'm going to film the man, I should give him something. So hopefully he's happy with the 10 bucks and I hope he can use it. Uh, you know, people always have in their mind what, uh, what uh, panhandlers, whatever you want to call them, uh, do with the money you give him. Honestly, it's not my business what he does with it, but damn. Well, they got, they got that blocked off, so I imagine they're doing something up above that is causing debris to fall. Oh man, that's so loud. I see, they're doing whatever that is. Hello, Victor Alexander. Mr. Bradshaw. You're the first one here. Of course, I'm always early. I care the most. How's it going, man? Good. Oh, I didn't realize. 
I don't know. Okay, wait, we want to start home. Oh, look at this plane. That's a piece. That's a good one, hey? That's a piece, man. Wow. Is that, what is that based off of? Like a World War II poster or something? Yeah, it's, uh... It's Amelia, isn't it? That's a nice no, one. No, no, oh, it's not. Look at this one. It's your girlfriend. <laughs> Facebook too. Thank you. Got daddy oh, Yeah. Okay, we're gonna stash these though, right? You're saving these for an unveiling? Yeah. Well, that was, uh, that was Sharon's idea anyway. We should what do you want to? cool. We should cut, cover them when people come, then we all unveil do we, do we have something we can cover them good with you? Right here. Okay, okay. Do you hear when uh, Trevor did no, I never made it to that show because oh, of my okay. dumb head, but my dumb head. I don't know what you want me to do, though, per se, but... Oh, wait, 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 wait. We want to put cardboard behind that. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Ah, <laughs> the perfect size. You almost think I knew what I was doing. Yeah, you got lucky. Up. That's real. Cool. <laughs> Ah, what does that, that say, attention That's lady? Not good at all. What? Yeah, oh. who the heck is that? Who did that? Gallery? Gross. Throw that out. Burn it. <laughs> Should I not put that in there? Okay, but what do you want me to do when we unveil these? Okay. I'm just gonna look like a st no, stupid idiot, that. being like, "These are my new pieces." Yeah, just be exactly. and tell, just talk about this piece. Like, say something cool. Like this, you know, I was uh, watching some World War II battles and it inspired me to do, uh, right? Okay, that's half true. Right? Just say something. Okay. Hey, do you have markers to sign stuff when people bring stuff? No. We don't have markers. Of course you don't. No, seriously. Yeah, of course you don't. Why would you? I'll go get some. Mr. Alexander. I got some for everyone. What's that? Oh, I don't know, a couple hours. It's just a matter of uh, patience, I guess, and skill, whatever. I don't didn't have very much skill when I first made it. <laughs> Learning. Yeah. Okay, now that I got my marker, I'm gonna help outside here. Sharon should be here with something. She's not even here. There she is. Oh. Hey, oranges? Oranges. Why not? Wow, you're looking fancy. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, that doesn't, that's not going to go on there. Wait, it can go on that one, though. That seems sketch. It does, but it works. Okay, I'm taking it. I'll lose the buns. Maybe grab those buns. Grab those buns, Sean. Oh, yeah. Whoa, almost hit that. <laughs> it's handy that you guys are right by the exit. It sure is. I assume she's going to want to come in that way, so it's going to You guys have so, so much art back here. Doctors get your stuff all figured out? No, but I am going blind, so that's good news. <laughs> so am I, so <laughs> good news is it may take you decades. <laughs> no, it'll take about a year. Oh, that's not good. No. Nope. There you go. Hey! Good, how are you? Good, good. Shane's here. For signing. For what? I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Got to sell all that whole wall of yours. If we get, if we get there, that's we don't need to empty the whole thing. Right? Basically, all set up now. Uh, I don't know. I've never had a show with these guys, so we'll see how it goes.
sold some. Yep. Right on. I knew you would need that marker. <laughs> Almost killed it. Almost had to buy something. Yeah, you almost had to buy something. That's a dragonfly. Yeah. You don't like that piece? I think with all the art that you have, it would fit right all your good stuff. I'm over. I'm over there. Oh yeah. So we're going to do a door prize, so whoever has it put in, if you can put your draws in, and then we'll do a door prize right away. This one's just a small box of chocolates. The first guy is Vinny Ram. I do another one? Yep. This one's a $50 gift certificate for our London Dairy Mall. Donated by Londonderry. This is one, one. One. Yeah. That yeah, you won. You won a fifty dollars <laughs> card. <laughs> yeah, spend it here on on that wall over there, especially. So the gallery just started carrying a new artist. This is his work. I really dig it. It's really sick. What's your name? Uh, Tisk. Tisk. It was my graffiti name when I was a kid. Yeah, yes, hello, this is Mr. Lee. Uh, one of the neighborhood kids is uh, spraying graffiti right now. Yeah, Tisk, Tisk, you shouldn't do that. Oh, that <laughs> is what it is. Dude, I like it, okay. Sweet. Sweet. So, you're uh, obviously inspired by Japanese. That's Japanese, right? Yeah, these are haunted masks. And yeah. then you got some skulls and stuff. This one's my absolute favorite here. Nice. That one's really awesome. Thank you. Actually, all of them are awesome. So I was told by Sean that you're a, you're a tattoo artist. That's yep. correct, yeah? yeah? So does your work, did you start tattooing after the graffiti thing then, or? Yeah, it's pretty much. I started doing graffiti before. Yeah, that's. Yeah. I hear a lot of people who who do graffiti, that it's like that's the first thing, because you can, you can, you can't tattoo when you're a kid, but you can, spray a wall when you're a kid. Yeah. When did you start doing graffiti? Uh, I kind of later, like when I was like 16, 17. Okay. Yeah. And then you got into doing tattooing and then into this or into this as well? or? Uh, I got into tattooing or started working in the shop when I was 18. Okay. Yeah. And then I uh, started like oil painting kind of like a year after that or so. Okay. Cool. Yeah. So all of your pieces are oil? You don't experiment with acrylic or airbrushing or anything, or do you? I have, these are all oil. I have airbrushed a little bit. I've used acrylics like once, but I just didn't jam with them. So. You just like the oil? Yeah. 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 Well, it's really nice work. Thank you. So if you guys are interested in following him, I'll put his info in the description like always. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Loretta. You're welcome, Josh. Want me to hold that Yeah, you should draw. You should pull the names this time. I don't have a pencil. You don't? Oh, ah. I was like, you don't need a pencil, but I, I see what you did there. <laughs> Remember, everyone's going to be mad at you that don't win. Then you do. It's Lyle Kim. It's a little picture donated by Kincaid Studios. Not Kincaid because he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. 
Who is it? I can't read. You can't read? Oh, here. Sherry, Sherry McLean? Sherry McLean. What, they're not here either? Very dramatic. Okay, that's it. It's over. Everyone is gone. It went. It went well, I think. Do you think it went well, Blaine? We maxed out with the people we had. We maxed out with the people we had. Unfortunately, there wasn't a lot, so I felt it might be best if I left the unveiling of these pieces for tomorrow because they're going to have a second show at the other gallery over in West Simpson Mall. To be honest, I've never done an un unveiling before, but they asked me to do it, so I was like, sure, I'll do it. And I just felt weird to do it. Having more people there, I'll probably feel even more weird, but tomorrow's the last chance to do it. Sharon, was it a good show? Yeah. It was? Yeah. Good. Every artist sold something? Yeah. Wow. Even this guy? Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> okay. Um, do you need help with anything else? You're good? All right. I'm going to leave before this demonetizes my video. See you tomorrow. You're welcome. Apparently, that's how you clean an escalator. I wouldn't have thought that. Huh. Okay. Now remember last time there was a show here at this gallery? I got locked in this vestibule. Let's see if that happens again. Ah! It opens up. And I'm parked way over there. Alright. To be continued. second art show today. I'm going to run late because, as you can see, I don't have a dress shirt because, well, I thought I had a spare, but since I haven't built my closet, I still don't have my all my clothes out, and I have no idea where my dress shirts are. So I'm coming here hopefully find one that I like.